Several people are displaced and multiple pets are still missing after a major apartment fire in Eastern Carolina. According to Greenville Fire and Rescue officials, the fire started around 9 a.m. at the Traybrook Apartments off of Fifth Street and the blaze was so intense that you could see that smoke from our Greenville Tower Cam as you see here. Justin Lundy was the first reporter on the scene and is live now with the latest information tonight. Justin. Yes, the flames are out, but as you said, the flames were so intense we could see the smoke from our studio right off of Arlington Boulevard. And as you can see behind me, there is a huge hole in the apartment building where the fire took place. But there is a long recovery ahead for many of the tenants who lost everything. Enormous flames shooting out of the roof of a Traybrook apartment building around 9 a.m. Monday morning. The flames were so intense off of Fifth Street. Smoke could be seen from our WITN tower camera on Arlington Boulevard. The first people to witness the blaze was Candace Bell. She says while waiting to pick up her boyfriend outside of the apartment, she saw the blaze and jumped out of her car with a cast on her foot. I went to the place, to the building, and started beating on all the doors and went, ran upstairs, beat on all those doors, and then came down and tried to make sure everything was good on the other side too. She doesn't call herself a hero, but is thankful adrenaline made her forget about her injured foot. It's been a rough go with my foot, but I didn't care. It was about saving all these people out here. According to Greenville Fire and Rescue officials, one firefighter was taken away on a stretcher after battling the flame. And several animals were unaccounted for, including Kayla Licklois, who was distraught because not only did she live on the second floor of the apartment building, but her cats, Remy and Lily, were also inside. I was trying to accept the whole time because it had been hours, so I, I was like, there's no way, there's no way. And um, because of the smoke, um, even with everyone trying to reassure me, it was really difficult. After almost giving up, firefighters greeted Lukloy with a special surprise. Oh, That's what I said, I said she needs nothing else. Yeah. Her cats. Um, an emotional moment that left her speechless. There were there were no there were no words. They're like, they're my girls. So, yeah. And though there is a possibility that she lost everything, she's just glad her pets made it out alive. I don't have any family here, and so um, they're what like gets me up every morning with all of the like, you know, pawing at me and everything. And they're 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 my girls, and so I just am. It means the world to me to have them. I don't know what I would do without them. A beautiful reunion there, and Lickloy wants to let the firefighters know that, uh, to, that she's thankful for their hard work. And the apartment complex is home to several ECU students, and a spokesperson for the university says that they'll be working with Red Cross to help out all the displaced residents. But for now, reporting live in Greenville, Justin Lundy, WITN News. Dave. All right, thanks, Justin. Crew stayed on the scene all day to monitor the hot spots. The SBI is investigating the cause of that fire.